Back so soon? Back so soon? Yes. <laughs> and welcome back to another video i'm back and i'm back sooner than i thought i was going to be back which is always good <laughs> the last video was literally last week and i did almost like a christmas special thing where my sister asked me i call it christmas special it had nothing to do with christmas but my sister was just asking me questions that people had previously asked me about my first term at university and i was just answering them so if you haven't watched that do check that out after this video but in this video i'm going to be talking about 2021 i'm happy yeah but i'm not sure if i'm happy we'll see if i'm still happy by the end of 2021 because 2020 <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh <laughs> i'm so confused like what was that year what what was that i mean you know some people were really depressed some people were really frustrated some people weren't really affected me i was just confused the whole thing just confused me you know you're just watching the news and you're thinking like what is going on like what is going on with this world i don't i don't know you don't know like we're living in crazy times people even as i speak i'm in tier four I didn't even know there was a tier four and I'm in tier four. So you can imagine, I hope when I watch this video back in like years to come and I remember the time when I was in the pandemic, I look back and think, oh my gosh, how far we've come because it's crazy. But yeah, okay, so I've decided I'm gonna do a video about the beginning of 2021 not the beginning but like what people usually do you know when you try and say yeah i'm gonna go to the gym but you really not you're just gonna pay for a membership and then not ever go or like when you say oh i'm gonna eat healthy and you have a few carrots like january 1st january 2nd by 3rd you're eating chocolate cake <laughs> like we all do it but i'm going to be talking about some of the long-term goals aims i'm gonna be that person if if you guys i don't know if it was just my school that did this but they showed that will smith like really motivational speech if you haven't watched it go on youtube type in will smith motivational speech you'll see it straight away dangerous it is to allow other people to determine how you're going to feel about me. i'm gonna be that person that person like very you know motivational but at the start of every year i like to kind of have some goals some ideas now that could just be something social like choosing your friends more wisely choosing who you spend your time with what you're going to spend your time doing it could be something academic like actually doing your work <laughs> it could be something spiritually like being more open-minded and happy just being happy because let's be honest 2020 was not a happy year for a lot of people and i think even though we joke about the fact that it's been a crazy year it hasn't been the easiest year for a lot of people so going into 2021 i'm going to show you what i kind of do just to kind of get my goals onto paper i'm definitely more of a graphic person so i've decided to try and show you how i'm gonna make my vision board for 2021 so i'm gonna be doing a tutorial today where i'm gonna be like one of those youtubers that is like Okay, let me go let me go get my glue here i have my scissors you know like the makeup people do so it focuses I've got my scissors this brush is from backstage beauty i've got my glue <laughs> whether you're old young boy girl like a lot of people could do with this because i think 2020 really has a way of making you just lose all vision <laughs> I mean, when it got near to the end of the year, I was just thinking like, wow, like, what do I do now? What, what do I do with myself? That's why I've decided to show you how 
I usually make my vision board. I made one last year, which was quite successful, and I use it as a, as a display in my uni room. And I've decided to make kind of a smaller version of that, but for 2021. So hopefully you can kind of get an idea of what it is I'm kind of waffling about this whole time. <laughs> um, I went onto Canva. You can just use a Word document if you want to. Um, and I just copied and pasted some icons, some pictures of things that represented things. They may not be obvious, they may be almost like a pun, like it looks like something but it means something completely different. Um, just because I like to keep my goals to be personal but still at a level where I can put it on display. So that's why you, if you do look at my vision board, there are quite a few cartoons like kind of referencing things. I copied and pasted them onto Canva and then downloaded the three pages. You can just print straight from the Word document if you want to. Um, once I printed them off, I then I just started cutting things out, sticking them, rearranging them, making sure that it looks almost presentable because I'm hanging this up in my room. Um, if you want to decorate your room, this is a very cheap, cost effective way of decorating your room. Um, and I got most of these things from, obviously, apart from like the glue stick and the scissors, I already had that. But the frame um, and the lights I got from Amazon, then used the board that's already in the frame as a template put all the pictures on top of it um and then i put the board back onto the frame as the lights is very optional i like the idea of lights because i just wanted it to have that bit of you know extra because that's what i am extra <laughs> but if you don't want lights you don't need light this is a really good way of kind of reminding yourself on a daily basis what it is that you're trying to achieve we need to strive to achieve and obviously i don't know if i've said this before but this can be for anybody whether you're boy girl male female if you're adult child it doesn't matter i'm in tier four i have time to do this but yeah like it can be anything it could be sports it could be you know where you see yourself in terms of your career it can be where you see yourself in terms of uni um and it doesn't even need to look like mine it can look any way you want so this is what it looks like i don't know if you can really see it but that's what it looks like now i know i usually do videos that is usually talking about my experiences or something funny or whatever whatever i just feel like it was appropriate i don't really know why i just felt like the need to kind of change it up a bit do a bit of a tutorial um of kind of how to get that vision back and reclaim that motivation because I'm, I'm gonna be honest in 2020 there was a point a very long point where I just felt very demotivated everything was just so negative pessimistic like I just felt almost just drained like drained, like emotionally mentally physically like I was aching why are my bones aching I'm in my teens <laughs> but I just felt drained. So doing something like this will put things into perspective and hopefully in 2021, you'll get that motivation, that drive back. Uh, my Instagram is Christina underscore unlimited. If there is something that you feel like has inspired you from what I've said in this video, make sure to tag me, make sure to let me know. I'd be really intrigued to actually find out, you know, what it is that you've come up with, um, what it is you've created maybe, so that I can see how I've really impacted people. Because sometimes when you do YouTube, you don't really realise how much you impact people until, you know, they tag you or they show you or they subscribe or something like that. So Hope you liked my little tutorial. Um, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, all of that good stuff. Especially to share it with people because I think there's this common feeling of feeling demotivated, just drained. You just want things to go back to normal. You just want an element of like normality or even working. Things that you complained about before you just want it to go back like i just want to see people do you know what i mean i hope that's helped somebody i hope that's encouraged and inspired someone to kind of reconsider their goals reconsider what they're trying to achieve it's so easy to just feel like what's the point but um yeah 
that's it until next time <laughs>